Hello, my name is Jonah Gelzo, Audio Tuts Plus and AE Tuts Plus author. I'm pleased to present my review of Photography and Cinema's PicoFlex Dolly and PNC Compact Tripod Ball Head. Now, anyone who has a DSLR in their kit bag dreams of picking up a fancy DSLR slider for snagging some really unique movement shots. Having some subtle smooth movements in your shots really gives way for a lot of visual appeal and helps add spice to your projects. The downside is that DSLR sliders are quite pricey. And when it comes to me and many of you who are run and gun shooters, mobile filmmakers I'd like to call us, we rely more or less only on the equipment we can stuff into our kit bags and go with at a moment's notice. And when mobility is key, at least for me, the slider undesirably gets left at home. Most sliders, albeit how awesome they are, are still, well, kind of bulky and heavy. It's great when you have the time and manpower to haul and move a slider around, but on the flip side, what do you do when you don't have that? Not to mention an outpouring of greenbacks. Now, when a small crew consisting of myself and two others started prepping for an overseas documentary shoot in Japan, we knew one of the most important things we needed to keep in mind was complete mobility. That meant having discretion upon the gear we'd bring along with us. Now, again, if it don't fit in the kit, then let it sit. However, it just made us ache realizing that it was probably in our best interest to leave the slider at home. Now, we hated to have to sacrifice getting cool movement oriented shots, but having a little time to research and pick up any extra odds and ends we needed for the trip, I stumbled across photography and cinema's PicoFlex Dolly. Two things really got my attention. Number one, the fact that the Pico Dolly utilizes wheels, which allow you to rock and roll on whatever surface you have available, instead of utilizing ball bearing and rails on typical sliders. Number two, the affordable price tag, beginning at under $100 for the wheels and sled. So for a fifth of most standard price sliders, you can pick up a Pico Dolly. And the most appealing bit for our documentary crew was that it's super portable and lightweight and can easily be stored in our smallest kit bag. The Pico Dolly sled is sturdily constructed out of metal and utilizes fluid roller bearings and smooth wheels. The sled also offers three quarter 20 female threads, which allow you to mount various tripod ball heads or fluid heads for use with DSLRs or articulating friction arms when wanting to shoot with small cameras. I opted for the Pico Dolly kit, which included the articulating arm with universal camera holder, as well as choosing to pick up their PNC tripod ball head as well. I really like the articulating friction arm when wanting to get some cool shots when putting together some tutorials really quick utilizing my iPhone or another small video capturing device. It's super easy to adjust and get a number of different cool looking angles. However, what I would not recommend is mounting your DSLR to the friction arm, simply because it won't be rigid, but instead will induce a lot of shake into your shot. If you're planning to shoot with small phones or video recorders, the friction arm is great. And another thing I love about the friction arm is when I'm not using it to shoot footage, I simply take it off the Pico and mount to my camera shoulder rig, utilizing the arm as a way to externally monitor my shots using my portable LCD. While overseas in Japan, we even use the friction arm in Pico Dolly as another way to mount and adjust an additional light. It wasn't exactly what we intended to use it for, but since we forgot to bring the extra light stand we needed, it ended up fulfilling that extra need. All in all, having a friction arm on hand served us in a variety of ways when we weren't using it with the Pico. Now, if you're planning to exclusively use a DSLR for shooting with the Pico, then you'll want to pick up the PNC tripod ball head or something really similar. However, what I really like about photography and cinema's PNC ball head is that it's compact and small, really easy to adjust and level with bubble indicators, as well as angle increment markings for precisely setting up shots. It also maintains a low profile, so by keeping your camera as close to the sled surface, your shots will be the most smooth and shake or wobble free. For under $50, the ball head was very well made, certainly rugged in build and all tightening knobs and Arca Swiss type quick release plate are well made and securely tightened in place and can support cameras up to six pounds. 
And with the included quarter 20 insert on the ball head, it's easy to interface with quarter 20 threading or 3 8 16 threading when you remove the insert. You also have the option to simply get the Pico Dolly with the packaged PNC tripod ball head for the same bundle price as the Pico with friction arm, which allows you to save money and really tailor the Pico to your needs. With the Pico Dolly, any decent surface on location is an opportunity for you to have some really interesting movement oriented shots. And with the Pico, you're not just limited to dolly in or out, forward backwards movements, or trucking left or right movements parallel to your subject, but with the adjustable wheel axles, you can orient the dolly to track a shot in a circular movement. And that's one feature you don't get on a slider. The Pico Dolly is another one of those DSLR accessory gems out there that are extremely affordable and offer the added spice of movement in your shots. And when mobility is key in run and gun shooting, the Pico Dolly delivers. It'll fit in just about any size kit bag, big or small, so just throw it in and go. The Pico Dolly is so unobtrusive, simple, and just fun to use, you'll find yourself finding any excuse to use it. Any relatively even surface is a Pico Dolly shot in the making. And when things are less than ideal, just head to Photography and Cinema and pick up their Pico Dolly mat for increased shooting situations. Now, while I only have personal experience with the Pico Dolly, Photography and Cinema does offer a host of other great economical DSLR accessories, such as the larger Komodo Dolly, as well as DSLR cages, rigs, and additional accessories. So be sure to check them out. Thanks for watching. I'm Jonah Gelzo. Happy filmmaking.